A lot of Indians are now buying smartphones instead of regular mobile phones. So has that ended the digital divide? No, because as people would recognize, you need data plans, you need access to content, and maybe there are language barriers to overcome. Similarly, in electricity, people are saying electrification is being done. And yes, the statistics are positive, very impressive, and many villages, in fact, some 98% are electrified. But what does it exactly mean to be electrified? The earlier definition from 2004 or 5 or before was if electricity reached the village and a single bulb was there, then the village was deemed electrified. Since then, the definition was updated to require household level electrification, at least 10% of households to be electrified, which is a great step. And now people are saying, why don't we even think of 50% or eventually now 100% household level electrification? That's the next step. Now there's one more thing that's missing in all of these, which is actual delivery of electricity, the service on those wires. If people are being load shed, especially for when they need electricity, which in rural homes is in the evening, 6 to 10 p.m., then they're not necessarily meaningfully electrified. We've done extensive work at Brookings India looking at the issues of defining electricity, what are the service levels that come with electricity and shortfalls. And so we think it's now time for a new conversation on new definitions of quality or meaningful electrification, which are not just the wire, which is a great step being undertaken today, but also service on that wire.